Some business owners in the ballpark district of Salt Lake City say they are fed up. For the past year, they say they've been experiencing serious issues with the homeless. ABC4's Nicole Newman joins us live from that area now to explain. Nicole? Hi, Rick and Emily. Well, the area we are specifically talking about is Paramount Avenue. It's where the Gail Miller Resource Center is located. This afternoon, I spoke with the owner of Diggity Dog Resort. It's a daycare boarding and grooming business for dogs. It's also located directly across from the center. Its owner, Michelle Goldberg, says she's losing clients and employees at a rapid rate. She shares her experience with us. A day after the center's director pleaded with the mayor and police chief to protect surrounding businesses from from the unsheltered during a council meeting. There's a lot of um, fighting, screaming, swearing, agitating, panhandling of my customers. Um, violence, violence, violence. Yes, <laughs> um, there's been a lot of violence um, and un just unrest. Yes, I have been threatened. I've been threatened by people who are just you know, they're angry and they're just kind of looking for a fight and that's kind of the situation a lot of the time. Now, during this meeting, the police chief did say that his department is working on stepping up patrols as well as bike patrols in the ballpark community as a whole. The people we talk to here say the sooner the better. Live in Salt Lake City, Nicole Newman, ABC4 News.